Hello, welcome to a video. Um, this isn't a week in tobacco, it's just basically me showing you my new pipe. Um, finally, after... It's only taken 10 years. <laughs> uh, I finally got a Lee Van Cleef Meerschaum. And I've wanted one for a long, long time, but they're quite expensive, aren't they? Last week I decided to um, <clears throat> to um, pull the trigger on a pipe I've wanted for a long time, a Grail pipe, if you like. Yeah, a Lee Van Cleef Meerschaum. This is my doing. I always put electrical tape around the stem because I tend to bite it. Yeah, it arrived within four days from Turkey. Um, that's pretty good, isn't it? That's pretty good. All the way from Turkey. By TNT. It was delivered from TNT. Perfect condition. And it's a beautiful, beautiful made pipe. Just... Yeah. Just cool as anything. You just... The quality of this Meerschaum is really, really special. It's block Meerschaum. <clears throat> not, not a pressed Meerschaum. Beautiful stem. There is quite a little mixture of colour in there of different yellows and clearer um, properties, but uh, the whole thing, I think it's uh, beeswaxed, so it gives that lovely yellow uh, effect. And of course, round the, uh, the top of the bowl, you've got that darker little stain which makes it very, very similar to uh, the pipe Lee Van Cleef smoked. So yeah, finally I've got my grail, my holy grail <laughs> pipe, and I'm very, very happy. Yeah, I saw it on eBay, and I actually um, didn't think I could afford it, uh, but no one else luckily bid on it. <laughs> I don't know if it was listed wrong, but I've been looking at these for a long, long time, and some are not accurate to the... Uh, to the one that Lee Van Cleef smoked. Uh, the one that I found is pretty, pretty close, um, and I'll show you their, their little card, is from Jay Ishtamirsham. Um, these guys, if you go on uh, Facebook and eBay and I don't know what all of those are, <laughs> Twitter and, no, not Twitter. Well, whatever those things are at the bottom, I can I recognise a couple of them, um, Facebook and and whatnot. Anyway, Jay Ishtamirshim. <laughs> yeah, so I'm over over the moon with this beautiful pipe. Um, smoke's cool, just beautifully made. Stems just in wonderful, wonderful condition. Everything aligns beautifully. Um, smokes everything cool. I'm smoking a, <clears throat> some of this, which is. Uh, Dr. Bradley mixture, which was uh, sent to me by um, Tim. Uh, what's Tim's handle now? Uh, not it's not Wolf Valley boy. It's um, uh, Hobbit Piper. Um, he's a lovely chap. So uh, really, really enjoying that. But you know the uh, came in this box. I oh, finished it. <laughs> came in this box which uh, I think is a really beautiful touch it's lovely isn't it very very good service great quality nice little box you know when you buy a pipe from Turkey a Meerschaum pipe they do really really deliver um, you know I've got a three, three quite you know, good quality Meerschaum pipes, and they all smoke beautifully. But yeah, this is a this is a fantastic smoking pipe. So yeah, that's my uh, new pipe purchase, a Holy Grail of mine, and something that I'm going to really, really enjoy over the years. And hopefully, you know, when I'm not around anymore, someone else might pick it up and go, "What a smoker!" 
I'll um, leave a little link to um, the Lee Van Cleef tribute to this pipe when he's in the bar and he strikes the match, if people remember, and he goes to light the pipe and yeah, if you remember that you've uh, you, you know you know what this pipe's about. But yeah, happy as anything. So the next video is going to be my week in tobacco. What have I been smoking so far? Um, just everything really, including this, which I thought I'd gone off slightly. I hadn't at all. Very bready, um, sweet Virginias. A really nice note. You def it definitely needed a good few months, as in, when was this? 2019, September, nearly a year. It needed a nearly a year in the jar for this to, um, you know, really kind of mellow and mature. I've got tins of this, and um, someone said it's very, very reminiscent of um, McClellan's uh, Christmas cheer. Not entirely sure about that. I had one tin of Christmas cheer <clears throat> in 2016, and... Um, I liked it, but I wasn't blown away. I wasn't blown away. I found their their anniversary series much more enjoyable. Um, but this, I think this is really nice too. This is lovely. So there we go. Uh, new pipe. Happy days. Um, it's amazing what a new pipe can do to uh, lift the mood, isn't it? So yeah, I'm going to... Finish off this bowl and uh, relax. See you uh, in a couple of days or maybe next week. I hope you're all well and take care of yourself. Cheers. <laughs>